In the Back of the Book segment tonight, the passing of Hollywood royalty. Carrie Fisher, the daughter of Debbie Reynolds and Eddie Fisher, died today at the age of 60 after having suffered a medical emergency on board a flight to Los Angeles last week. Fisher was an actress and a prolific writer, but she's best known for portraying Princess Leia in the original Star Wars. Now, Bill O'Reilly interviewed Fisher back in 2004 when she was pr promoting her book, The Best Awful. We thought you'd like to see that interview. There's a million books out there, very tough sell these days, and take it from me, I know. Um, what would I learn investing money and time in your book? Well, um, it's, a, it's a sequel to a book I wrote called Postcards from the Edge. Very which successful, is about, Meryl Streep film. Yep. Um, well, it's about uh, Suzanne Bale, an actress in Hollywood who's the daughter of a celebrity uh, who gets left by a man for a man. Okay, so you're dumb. For it's not. It's very different from me. No, it isn't. Oh, I'm sorry. It isn't. <laughs> no, it's what happened to you. It's but look, what happened to me. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to get this story, and I'm going to. Some guy leaves you for another guy, and I mean, he's crazy. I mean, I wouldn't have done it. Um, Thank you. But what am I going to learn? Well, you're going to learn what it's like for then. Um, Suzanne goes off her bipolar medication to find a straight guy. Yeah. That's how you do it, isn't it? I have no idea. I turned you straight when I got in the outfit in the third you bet Star you did. Wars. Right. But I didn't have much, much. Um, you didn't have to coax me too much. I was pretty much there. That's why I have to take the bipolar right. medicine and throw it away. So this now. is basically an adventure. Uh, through these Hollywood uh, labyrinth. All right, and I think that's going to do well. People are interested in that. Now, let me, let me talk about you. You do a show on Oxygen, yes. the, the Babe Channel, right? The now, Babe Channel. Yeah, I cruise right. through that once in a while because I like, I like, like babes. babes. I, like I babes. heard you. All right. I but made you heterosexual. I, I, I saw you and Susan Sarandon together, and okay. I was very confused. Let's roll Were the you? clip. Okay. I say to Bill O'Reilly, gets a lot of llama. Get a, get, give him a, a whole llama. lot of llama. A whole lot of llama has been given on your behalf. So kill him with kindness. Yeah. No. Send Bill O'Reilly a bunch of bees, llamas, yeah, yeah. And, and pigs and goats. Mm -hmm. And meanwhile, these people will be starting a whole people new life. Benefit. Sending their kids to school and, because you know, they now he can loves afford it. Leading heart liberals. Yeah. And bees. Don't, Don't, that's what, not what confusing was, what was at that all. all about? Well, she is a charity where people uh, send people llamas and uh, llamas. bees. And, don't you think that uh, and people are done that does a lot of people some good for her charity? And in the meantime, right. you get llamas and bees and bunnies. All right, but I never got any llama. But why would well, I want a llama? Upsetting. And what good is that going to do somebody to get? Well, it? you don't know until you get it. Mm. So it might, Susan you know, Sarandon is sending people llamas. What if they don't want a llama? She sends it anyway. Well, I think what you do is hey, get that llama off my lawn. Llama and the people get to, a right. lot of all right. With all due respect, Miss Fisher, I had no idea what you guys were talking about there, but I suspect I'm not looked upon with favor by the Hollywood community. Am I correct? I think you're misunderstood. I think you're misunderstood, and you've got to come out there. They don't know that you the love. The real me. They don't know the real cuddly you. Right. Your inner child. They don't, they don't know, know that. about that. Right. You, Bill, that loves disco music. Right. That's true. You read my book. Excellent. They don't know that. Mm -hmm. And if they knew that, I think there would Even be a Susan lot of. Even Susan Sarandon, you think she would we'd embrace We'd all me? be at the airport sobbing and playing disco music, right. Donna Summer cheering. As Come me, in. As me and the llama left. As you well. To go back to New York. Both. <laughs> leaving and coming in. <laughs> leaving and coming in. But really, they really don't like me out there, do they? They don't like your politics, some of them. Which are what? I'm an independent. I thought you were conservative. On? That's what my mother told me. Your mother, Debbie Reynolds. My mother, Debbie Reynolds. She loves me, though, right? She does love you. Right. I would have been really good in Hollywood in the 40s and 50s. You're when... still good. My mother is, st they're still running around, She's the conservatives, and my mother's right. still a babe. And it's not just right. my mother's But Susan Saran and she, I'm not going to win her over, am I? You're not going to win Susan, and the other conservatives <laughs> golf a lot. So you're going right. to have to go I think you them. guys are reading me wrong, but that's okay. We want everybody to buy your book, The Best Awful. And uh, we really appreciate you coming in here, Miss Fisher. Nice thank you. It's been you. a pleasure. Right. And really, thanks a lot for the Princess Leia deal. Oh, thank you for yeah. turning straight. Yeah, I turned really, the other guy it gay. Wasn't, it this wasn't turning. I, I think I was always there, but it oh. was encouraged me. That's good, too. Our thoughts go out to the family of Carrie Fisher.